Cheers, everyone! This is Blaster Brewmaster here, and welcome back to Magic the Gathering, Duels of the Planeswalker 2015, Garrick's Revenge, and the whole nine yards. Anyways, so instead of doing this as a stream, I just decided to kind of finally get back to doing some more of the long play stuff. So, last time I was still over here in Innistrad, but I had finally finished up with Avacyn. Avacyn. So we're going to go back here, because now we're starting up on Theros. Now, if you don't remember too much, I was running a red-black, called it a sack deck, but really at this point it's no longer a sacrifice deck. There's not really a lot to sacrifice, it's more like a vampire power deck, I guess, so an undead vampire power deck. So that's what we're going to go with. So let's start up here with Hydra Attack. So, as you move through the thick forest, in Inscrutable. Inscrutable. No. Inscrutable hissing comes from every direction. Suddenly a monstrous creature lunges at you. Its many heads strike out, hungry for your flush. Okay. Uh, that is a way too much black land, I think. Doesn't give me a lot here. Because uh, I can't cast anything, so let's draw a new hand and hope we get a little bit better. Okay, so I could at least bring something out. Let's keep this one. Alright, place... So uh, it goes first. Okay. Okay, doke. So, Black Land, and we can at least cast some Gul'dra's Vampire. If they have 10 or less, the Gul'dra's Vampire gets plus 2, plus 1, and then Intimidate. Let's go ahead and play that. Can't really do much else, so we'll just go ahead and roll through this. Okay, let's see what it does next. Nothing, okay. Let's see, cannot cast that. Put two... I'll go ahead and do Krenko's command, get two uh, plus one red goblins. Go ahead and attack with that one. Can't really do much, so let's go ahead and see what else we get. At least gives me some sacrifice fodder too, and some defensive. Okay, Scourge of Skull of Ale. It's got Trample. Ooh, that's fun. So, with, if a creature with Trample would deal enough combat damage to its blocker to destroy them, it deals the rest of its damage to the defending player. So basically, in order to stop this thing, I've got to keep putting things to defend. Okay, so it starts with two plus one plus ones. Okay, don't show that again. Sacrifice another creature. Ooh, this one's going to be a bit of a tricky one. So I put... Uh, if they put in anything stronger, we get plus one, plus one counters on it that's equal to its toughness. So, defense, if I remember right. So, it starts out as a plus two, plus two with trample, and it can get worse from there. Okay, so speaking of that, then I should probably put this one up. No, I can't do that just yet, because I still need one more mana. I don't want that yet. Hmm. Alright, fine. I'll go ahead and cast the Walking Corpse, because the game wants me to. I'm going to stay on the defensive for now because I want to deal more with that, so I want to defend against that thing. It's a bit of a tricky one to work against. Okay, Lay of the Land. Search your library for a basic land card, reveal it, putting it in your hand, then shuffling your library. Not too bad. Not really anything I need to worry about now, but that gives it something for later. More now. Oh, hey, and look there. Okay. Feral Hydra. Feral Hydra enters the battlefield with X plus one plus one counters on it. Pay three, put a counter on it, any player may activate this ability. 
Hmm. This could actually be useful if I've got something to... I don't think I... I would have to... I'd have to capture it and then sacrifice it, because I've got the cards for both of those, but... Just leave it as it is. Can't really do too much at the moment. Alright. So let's put Marauding Mulhorn in. I'm gonna stay on the defensive still, though, because with those two in here, they're gonna be able to... just gonna be able to boost those pretty easily. That's gonna be kinda scary. Hmm. Protean Hydra. Protean Hydra. God, everything in here starts with X counters, so. How many. I wonder how many it's casting. I can't see that yet. Damage would be dealt to it. Prevent that damage and remove as many counters from it. Whenever plus one, plus one counter is removed from the Hydra. Put two plus one plus one counters on it at the beginning of the next and each step. Oh god, these hydras could be really tricky here. That's what I thought. So it's starting with maximum on that. Four. Okay. That is probably actually going to be useful, but I kind of want to use Mind Rot. Huh? Oh, geez, it just... So, that one right there, it just sacrificed it, didn't it? The Protean Hydra? Hmm. Huh. So... This can give me something, at least, if I cast any sorceries as well. Yeah. This will be useful for later on. I'm just going to keep building up my defenses, because right now it's going to be what I need. <clears throat> so... Because of the fact that this has to attack... That's why it's sacrificed, and it's going to use that to stop it. If I only had something else to use... You know what? Here. See if maybe I can at least take that one out if it wants to defend. If not, okay. So that at least is going to go out. That... You know what? Here. That card is now dead. It's still playing it carefully too. Pre-regrenation. <clears throat> Search your library for up to two basic land cards, reveal those cards, and put them on the battlefield tapped, and the other one on in the other hand. Okay, shuffle your library, then scry one. What is scry one? Scry and magic is an action that gives you some control over which cards you'll be drawing in the near future. To scry and means... To look at the top end cards of your library, put any number of them onto the bottom of your library. Put the rest of the cards back on the top. Huh. It's a little bit confusing to me. That was not something I remember back in the earlier days that I played this. So it still actually gets to put it down too, that's kind of a bit annoying. Okay, so I've got enough to start doing a Mind Rot. How did this end up... I'm gonna have to go back and look at the footage because I... It, did, it must have let it go through, okay. Start getting rid of its cards. Okay. Well, this one has trample, doesn't it? Uh, like I wish I could stop it from doing that, but I don't have Advocate of the Beast. Uh, the question is, because I mean, if I 
two, three, or let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, I'm just gonna let this roll. Just wish I had something to get rid of that one. Jeez. Okay, so it's still keeping it defensive. Boundless Realms. Search your library for up to X basic land cards, where X is the number of lands you control, and put them onto the battlefield tap. Jesus Christ, that's going to be like eight more. Jesus. I hope it doesn't have anything powerful now. Okay. Now, I don't know that I have any... I do have those vampires, but... They have to deal damage to the player. No, I think I'm going to cast this again. Give me another counter here. At least it's building up my defenses, but skip that attack. We'll come back for you next round. It doesn't want to attack me with that. X plus one plus one counters on it. Mm, that's lovely. Jesus. That was what I was afraid of because of it has that. Uh, okay. It's one plus three. Or plus three plus zero and has first strike. So... Question here. Three. I wouldn't have enough to cast both of them. I, uh, it's like at least if I do it on that. Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and cast it on the Pyromancer. Mm, it gives it a bit of a boost, but I am probably going to be screwed with that. Oh my god. I got no choice. Uh, Alright, well, let's throw everything at it, because I don't think it's going to do much. In fact, it's got trample, I'm fucked. Unless I somehow get a destroy target card in the next play, I am dead. Ugh. Jesus. I fucked. You know, we're gonna just go ahead and well, let's just let our fate roll. Oh boy, that was kind of dead. Yeah. Bye bye. Doesn't matter here. I'm dead. I am so fucking dead. That was a unanimous defeat. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, that was pretty bad. Okay. Well. I guess I'll come back to that one later on. God, I'm going to need something. I may have to build another deck just to try to take this on. Because if it gets that sort of setup, it's not much I can do against it. 
All right, well, guess that is it for today's little playthrough of Magic the Gathering. I got my butt looked bad by that Hydra. So, if you like that video, go ahead and give it a like, a comment, to subscribe, whatever you feel like it. Tell me how much I suck at that. Ugh. Goes me the shivers thinking about how much pain that was. In the meantime, go ahead and raise whatever you're drinking in the air, because I've got nothing. And have another one of me. Love and peace. Oh, fuck you. Ron Howard, save me with your delicious powerness of goody gingery. Ginger goodness. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. Oh, fuck you, fuck you. Oh, there. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. Fuck you. Rocky, Rocky, I feel your power coming within me, but I swear I will be able to fight them all off. I'll pick on Booker Lake.